That Herman police officer shot at a gas station in March is making incredible progress. Good evening, I'm Brent Solomon. The officer is getting extra love tonight from strangers and friends alike. Our Elise Schoenig was there for it all. Fill us in, Elise. Well, Brent, what started as a barbecue in honor of police officer Adam Solentrup became a community-backed fundraiser. Solentrup's cousin says Adam is walking, talking, and writing again. And he says Adam's strength has become an inspiration to communities across Missouri. A setback through tragedy becomes a comeback through inspiration. Oh, overwhelming. Jared Vollmer says his cousin Adam Solentrup has a long road ahead. It's been a long, uh, long eight weeks. Jared says Adam is recovering in Colorado after he was shot on duty in Herman in March. The progress he is making inspires me every day. Jared says the whole family feels the weight of this setback, but Adam is what keeps them going. We would think to ourselves, how am I supposed to be here frustrated while he's out there working so hard? Now, Jared says Adam can walk, talk, and write. He walks so fast, I don't think I could keep up. So that's the type of recovery that is just unheard of. And the silver lining is another thing to celebrate. So many people have told me how Adam's story has touched their lives in a positive way, and that is fantastic. The inspiration was clear at a Saturday fundraiser for Adam. The winner of this one happens to be uh, my uncle, Johnny Green. The room was packed with shirts, hats, and name tags sporting Adam. Who gets to change so many people's lives? But Adam Solentrup did, and so I'm proud he's my family, and I'm proud to fight for him. Setbacks turn into comebacks. <laughs> when a community <laughs> becomes a village. If you want to learn more on how you can support Adam and his family through his continued recovery, you can contact fightforadam508 at gmail.com. All right, Elise, thanks. We'll put that email on ksdk.com.